local weather authority with Chief Meteorologist Jesse Walker. Hey everybody, we have a wind advisory for the entire viewing area. Not a surprise there with all the wind we've had. This is now through early tomorrow morning. The wind will still be breezy tomorrow during the day, but will not be as windy as it will be during the overnight hours. These are wind gusts so far today. 39 mile per hour at the uh, airport in Terre Haute, 41 up here in Champaign and 40 in Mattoon. So we've already seen a lot of wind and we're not done. The storm system will move through tonight with a cold front. That's going to be also a big drop in the temperatures on the way. We hit 61 for the daytime high. Notice our low of 43. That's the average high for this time of the year. So really mild weather out there today and it's going to stay mild for a while, but that's going to change overnight. Not much rain so far. 0 0.03. So we're up to 1.47 so far for the month with one more day left. But we're going to tack a little bit more onto that tonight with some rain coming in with the cold front. The uh, river stage in Terre about four and a half feet is currently stationary. So we've got a front moving in for tonight. That's going to bring some showers, maybe a few thunderstorms. Then much colder weather moves in tomorrow, but a warmer start to the month of December. I think you're going to like the extended forecast and wet early next week. A little system coming in here along about late Sunday into Monday, Tuesday could bring some more needed rainfall, not snow because it's going to be mild, rain, rain to the area. 60 degrees at the airport in Terre Haute right now, so it's very mild. But look at these winds south at 18, gusting higher than that, and the pressure is falling rapidly from 2965 as our storm system develops and heads this way. Temperatures are right around 60 degrees or pretty close to 60 degrees. The storm itself is moving up this way. To the south, we've got severe weather. On the back side of it, we've got a snowstorm out here across portions of Minnesota into portions of Iowa, Wisconsin, and down to the south, severe weather breaking out down to the south of this area. So for us, on the Dorset Automotive Doppler radar, not much going on right now. Off to the west of this area, though, and this is right in advance of the cold front, we're seeing some showers developing, maybe a couple thunderstorms. Those will move into this area later on. And then down to the south, I wanted to show you, this is where our ongoing outbreak of severe weather is happening. All of these red areas, those are all tornado warnings, including this hash one down here, meaning a confirmed tornado. So big time severe weather outbreak down to the south, Louisiana, Mississippi, into Alabama, seeing the severe weather. For us, the front will move through, maybe a stronger storm with a little bit of wind in here. Notice the time on this about late news time. It'll clear the area probably by 1 to 2 a.m. And behind that dry weather moves in for the rest of the overnight. It'll be a lot colder tomorrow, even with the sunshine. And even as we head into Thursday, the first day of December, we're still talking about some sunshine, but cold weather. But after that, things look to get better. As a matter of fact, warmer weather moves in. It looks like by later this week and then rain chances again by early next week. So here's the forecast for tonight then. Again, it could be some showers or maybe a couple thunderstorms up until around midnight or so. Then the rain ends and the temperature will drop off quickly. 26 for the low temperature. For tomorrow, daytime high only in the 30s, even with some sunshine. We'll have some wind chills in the morning around 12 to 15, so it's going to get a lot colder, even with that sunshine. And then after that, you're going to stay cold as we take you into the day Thursday, but then after that, temperatures will warm up as we take you into the end of the week. How about a 52 Friday? A 55 on Saturday looks great. Rain showers developing Sunday into the first of next week, but overall, temperature's not bad to start the month of December. That's your forecast. Sports coming up right after the break. American Eagle Auto Glass.